I can't breathe in this thing! The day's not starting out on a good foot. Duplicates have died. Mima and Devon. And I bet you I just lost a really important skill somewhere. Uh, what did I lose? Go away. I lost. Lose my good researcher. Other good researcher. Art guy. Cook. Critter rancher. Uh, I'm not sure who I lost, but... <sighs> I put some digging on uh, on priority six just to get it done. And they sat there and dug until they died. And I'm going to lose someone else here, too. Uh, oh, because, oh my god, you morons. There's, uh, someone dug this out. I wasn't paying attention. Great. Yep, so those four guys. And Gosman's going to die, too. Yeah! We're off to a great start. <sighs> this game is everything I ever hoped it could be. You know, I really wasn't paying attention. I bet someone suffocated over here, too. Nope. I just went from 11 to 5. That's not... It's not fatal. It's really unfortunate. It's going to slow me down a whole bunch. But we'll recover. It's just going to take a while to uh, build the numbers back up. I don't get another person for another cycle in a bit. But we're good on food, we're good on water, we're good on. We're actually, great on oxygen. Except for those, except for them, of course. Except for them. I'm going to leave you guys in a hole. It's just going to take a while to rebuild. Well, I don't know how many cycles it's been. We're back up to 12 people. Finally. Uh, I think it's been like 20 cycles. I don't know. Did manage to pick up four people who were all night owls. So I put them all on night shift. Which is good. They get a bunch of stuff done while everyone else is sleeping. Like keeping the, keeping the batteries full. Oh, I got a hatchling egg. Built a stable around this hatch <laughs> and tamed it. Just don't have any power to run the incubator yet, but I don't think the incubators really need power. Oh, hey, cool. I built a stable around this sage hatch <laughs> and tamed it. So we'll get uh, we'll get sage hatch eggs. So a little bit of renewable coal. It's a, a, a bit of a payoff for losing half the crew. Uh, going to try and farm Paku. I had a fry egg. I think it died. No, it hatched. So I'll get a whole bunch of Paku. I can feed him um, seeds and stuff for Paku fry. And uh, they'll poop polluted dirt for me, as long as they're in polluted water. And finished off this great hall, built a hospital. So we've got a, f a fair amount of morale bonus just for rooms now. And making the steps into, into coal gin. I don't have a whole lot of coal. But it's not like it's not like coal is a, a scarce resource, right? I mean, there's there's lots of coal. Still have to figure out what we do with the slush geyser. I think 
if I uncover it and just let it run down here. I don't know how much it's going to make. The last one I tried made, uh, I unearthed it, analyzed it, and then it never went off because it wanted to wait like 70 cycles. I'm hoping this one's not quite as bad. It doesn't take as long. Oh, hang on. What's going on? Someone's, someone's suffocating because they spent too long in that pit. I did research things like carbon scrubbing and here decontamination, ventilation. Ooh, I should finish off plumbing. Liquid tuning while I'm at it. Water sieve. Got an ethanol distiller. Uh, I've only still only got the one Arbor Acorn. That doesn't mean I shouldn't. I just wait, right? Like the more. The more ethanol I have, when I can use it, the better. The longer it takes me to get to it, the more I'll have when I finally get there. They do create a massive amount of heat, though. So I think that slush geyser is going to be kind of required. Uh, oh, yeah, right. I built that thing. So when everyone's done pooing, I can replace these with hand sanitizers. And then we can stop using whoop water. I'll just get everyone to get done here. Okay. Come on, you okay, you're good. Uh deconstruct those. I have bleach stone. Ooh, I only have fifty seven of it. I get more. But it will help us we won't have to, we won't have to use as much water. Now, of course, everyone's going to run in there and not have a a wash bay, because I didn't think of that. Go get this. Go get that. Actually, if I just turn those into ladders, they'll fall down there. You can do that like that. Bleach stone. Bleach stone. Go get all of that. No, don't get that one. Don't get those. Because you'll fall and get stuck. Let's make these all priority six. So you actually go in and do something. Because I need that now. Oh, someone finally checked the security door. Well, what do you think is in here? We're going to get our first journal entry. I cleaned up a few messes in my time, but nothing like the mess I seen today in that biolab. Green goop all over the floor, all over the walls. Murky tubes that look like human shapes floating in them. They think old Mr. Gunderson ain't got the smarts to put two and two together, but I got eyes, don't I? Ain't no one ever pay attention to the janitor. The janitor pays attention to everybody. Mr. Stinky Gunderson. That might be how Stinky wound up becoming a, uh, a duplicate. He just fed him into the machine. Table, which does... I uh, can't even take this apart. Can't rebuild them. And you're gonna give me a snazzy suit, probably. What's in here? Pada! Thunk! Ooh, a nutrient bar. That's cool. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Complain, whine, cry. Now, uh, pick up all of this crap. Six, all of this crap. Mirth leaf. So we problem. Bomb lily flower storage unit available. Oh, because you're an industrial ingredient. No, you're a medical ingredient. Right. I gotta build a fridge up here to store. Okay, well. What's that gonna cost me? Rock. Okay, yep. Build me one. Don't even have to plug it in, it's just for medicine. We have a fantastic amount of life sloth. Making. Oh, better plant that one. Making fried mushrooms. And eventually, 
We'll move on to Paku Fry and some barbecue. And I watched tutorial. You can uh, you can if you store ice in these things, it'll cool down the. It's supposed to cool down the water. I've done it in a couple, but you have to fill the whole storage bin up. It's not bad. It's free cooling. No power. Oh, wait. I didn't put the power on. Uh, you get that. Tell me before I plug you in. Put a. Hmm. I didn't leave a lot of room for ugly connections and stuff. Hmm. But I'm going to need power. Because once I turn this thing on, I'll have to do something with all the carbon dioxide. And I'll need power for... Probably for lights, because I, I should start growing gristleberries. We got gristleberries, and then we found... So gristleberries and sleet wheat give you... Berry mash or berry mush? Berry something. And it's a nice high calorie food. Then keep throwing meal lice. These guys. Uh, and the only other cool thing we found in the end time was where is it here? Nope, there it is. A salt water geyser. A hot salt water geyser. An eat butt. I have to desalinate it. And seems like a bit of a waste, really. I mean, this cold slush thing over here. Cool. Hopefully that erupts on a really fairly decent time, because I could turn it back in a, into... I can use the water, the cold slush. I'm talking with my hands again. I can use the cold slush to cool the base down. And then process it into drink into usable water, and it's free. But I have to do all that setup and run a bunch of piping and run a bunch of wire and blah 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 blah. blah. And it's three a.m. <laughs> so that's going to be a next episode thing, and I will see you then, in the future.